Good afternoon, Recon here with TechOut, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to check your battery health and charge cycles on your Galaxy device. Um, this will work for uh, pretty much anything uh, current, uh, the S23 Ultra, S24 Ultra, any S23 or S24 for that matter, uh, as well as the Fold devices. Um, I have tested this on my Z Fold 4 as well, so it does go back to the Z Fold 4, it will work for the Z Fold 5. What you're going to need to do is you will need a computer for this. This isn't just something you can uh, do right here on your device. Uh, but what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to enable developer options. And the way you do that is you're going to go to About Phone and go to your software information. And then you're going to uh, tap on the build number five times until it enables the developer settings, which will be on the very, very bottom of your main settings page. And once you have that enabled, you're going to scroll down here to USB debugging, and then you're going to need the ADB platform tools on either a PC or a Mac. Um, you can just Google that and download the uh, latest ones from Google. Um, and then we'll go over here and I will show you guys what to do on your computer. All right, so once you have plugged in your phone to your computer and you've downloaded, downloaded the platform tools, I just keep mine in a folder right here just run a terminal uh, window at that folder and then you're going to want to enter this command right up here um, depending on how you have your uh, platform tools installed you may need a dot and a forward slash um, if not just do adb uh, adb shell dump sys battery and that's going to give you all this information about your battery right here some of this is just whether it's plugged in or not which obviously if it's plugged into your computer it's going to say it's charging via usb um, but what you're looking for is all the way at the bottom here where it says battery info backup and you're looking for two things here the m saved battery asoc that is the battery health right here so this is my s24 ultra you can see we are at 100 100 still obviously because the phone is only about a month old and then if we look down here uh, we can see M saved full status. Oops, sorry, wrong one. M saved battery usage. And the first, um, if it's uh, five digits, the first three are going to be your uh, charge cycles. If it's only four, it's going to be the two. So um, basically, the last two numbers do not, um, don't look at those. So in this case, my S24 Ultra is showing 29 battery cycles. If this was uh, 29, 924 then that would be 299 um, I will go ahead and run this uh, live for you guys as well um, so I'm going to plug in my my Z Fold 4 here which is a little bit older and we're going to open up a new uh, window here and I'm just going to I already have the command saved um, but we're just going to go ahead and run it again for this phone and you can see here on this one we are at 99 percent and then we do have a five digit number down here so it's 355 battery cycles on my Z Fold 4 which uh, is not bad for having 99 percent health um, so that is that um, that is how you can actually check your battery health and cycles on your Galaxy device. Since Samsung does not put this in the battery information or the settings uh, like Google does with the Pixels now and like Apple does with the iPhones and that kind of stuff. Um, hopefully maybe one day in an update, Samsung will bring battery health, um, you know, actual statistics to settings instead of just showing like good or, you know, bad or whatever it says in Samsung members on the diagnostics, but this is how you can use ADB to check for yourself. I'm Colin with TechOut. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and as always, have a great day.